For those of you who don't know, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe truly is the spiritual successor to Mario Kart Wii in the sense that if it keeps selling at this rate, it's going to outsell the console it was released on. Not that I'm complaining, because Mario Kart 8 Deluxe really was one of several diamonds in the rough that was on the Wii U. That being said, $60 port has never been a term that gamers use lovingly. Still, Deluxe is extremely well-rounded, offering a variety of characters, carts, and courses that will occupy you and your family for weeks. And yet, there's just an inexcusable lack of novelty and pizzazz, a hole where still unique characters and chaotically wacky tracks should be, even if you are able to drive a Mercedes-Benz. Fortunately, the battle modes in this game are nothing to sneeze at. Renegade Roundup and Shine Thief are especially delightful. In contrast, the online mode is quite unremarkable. There's nothing inherently wrong with it, it's just that losing online in Deluxe feels impersonal, or at least no less impersonal, unpredictable, and unforgiving than losing to CPUs. Though really, all you have to do to make the game feel personal is think about the price tag. 